guys, this is that one Apple Guy back at it again with another video. This is gonna be a quick one, but it's very exciting news. The Galaxy A54 5G today um is now this might be like from like a couple days ago, but today is May 20th, it's a Monday, and a new software update is available, One UI 6.1 is coming to the Galaxy A54. And I didn't think it was going to come to that Galaxy A54 because I know it's a little late on the A series, the updates, but I got it on my S21 and I really love the features and I wanted it on my A54. And it's here. So we can create epic images. Let's look at all the changes. So you can create epic images, copy and paste one image to another. Um, you get most accurate image clipping, get exactly the area you need to clip without any unwanted parts. You get improved gallery search, so search in the gallery has been approved if you want to search for a photo or whatever. You can now change the playback speed when you edit a video in gallery. You can edit videos on multiple devices now. And new for customization, we have new wallpaper editing features. Decorate your wallpaper however you like. When you select an image to use as your wallpaper, you can now apply frames and flex. When your wallpaper includes a person or an animal, you can reply if, apply depth effects to make a subject stand out from the background. So this is kind of like iOS 16, what they did. Um, more widgets for your lock screens. Now you get widgets just like the iPhone, so they're really copying iPhone on this. Um, we'll go over that in a minute. You get custom alarm alerts so you can use an image video or ar emoji to create your own custom alert screens for each alarm which is really cool we got more stickers for personalize your calendar so you can now up to add up the two stickers for each date on your calendar you get revamped calendar settings so um calendar settings has been reorganized to be more um intuitive you can now also set background colors and images for full screen calendar alerts. You also get do more with your reminder categories. Turn modes on and off the home screen. So you can turn modes on and off more quickly than ever before. The new mode widget lets you add modes directly to your home screen. You can also reorder your modes. New routine conditions. You can now start a routine when your alarm of your choice. So yeah, um, whatever that is. <laughs> And then there's other more features. So let's go ahead and install this now. This update is about 2 gigs. So it's a pretty big update. Let's go ahead and install it. I'll be back when we're done. Actually, I got to charge it more. But thanks to my Anchor 25-watt uh, power bank. I love this thing. Is it? Yeah, it's 30 watts. So it's really nice. And then it has this nice screen. So I'll be back when it's done charging. The 20%. Well, I'll be back when it's updated. The phone's charged enough. Let's hit install now. There we go. All right, so I cleaned up the space a little. Jesus. Well, I was waiting, so now it looks good. Now, in the next video, I will fix this, how it's keep turning. But, all right, so we are updated here. Let's swipe up. Let me draw in my pattern real quick. We should get a little pop-up right there. Welcome to One UI 6.1. All right, let's hit done. And we are into the phone. Now, I'm not going to check out any of the new features. I'm only going to check out those widgets because that's really freaking cool. So let me get this propped up. All right, so I got the phone propped up. Bet you haven't seen this before. Um, and I've got the uh, screen clean. Bet you also haven't seen that before because I never keep these phones clean. All right, so let's hold down. Let's go into the editor. Let's put in our fingerprint. And of course, the A54 can be slow sometimes. And right there, add widgets. Let's go ahead and click that. All right, so now we can add our widgets. So here we go. Here's batteries. They so can do battery status, whatever. So let me put in a battery widget. Not that battery widget. Or actually, let's do that. And then I also want to put in a weather widget. So now I can do this. And we'll hit done. And we should have our widgets all set up. There we go. That looks nice. And I want to see how it reacts with the always-on display. Because I don't use my S21 much. So I didn't really get to play around with One UI 6.1 yet. So let's just go ahead and see. 
let's go ahead and find always on display here. I'm going to turn it on. And what to show. Let's see if we can do widgets. Um, weird. Okay, so let's just do it. All right, and the widgets are working. That is so cool. I really love that. That's awesome. So I really recommend this new update, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate you guys supporting the comment, uh, the 